LB Blitz Zero is one of the glitchiest blitzes in Madden 24 right now. I'm going to show you how to run it in this video. A very simple setup, and if you can get the muscle memory down, this defense is actually going to be really, really good for you. Now, we have a full nickel 3-3 defensive ebook on the Patreon. Actually just dropped a full nickel 2-4-5 odd defensive ebook as well, making it our 13th offensive and defensive ebook of Madden 24. You get everything for just 10 bucks. Cool part about it is we've broken down a ton of stuff over there, so you can kind of play Madden however you want to. And members get access to all of the updates to those ebooks uh, as long as your membership is active. So make sure that you're in there. Let's show you LB Blitz Zero. Now, what you want to do is you do want to put your fastest, most high agility players at the defensive end positions, and it's going to be LB Blitz Zero. Now, what we're going to do here is I'm just going to move the balls to the Rana Hash mark. Um, there is some weird alignment bugs going on right now in practice mode. This will work significantly better in game. Okay, just keep that in mind. But what we're going to do is we are going to spread our defensive line. We're going to crash our defensive line down. We're going to globally blitz the linebackers. And then what I like to do here is we're going to move this linebacker out to the right, keep it contained, and then you're going to slide your linebackers to the left, and it will normally move this guy down here for you. Okay, if it doesn't, you can obviously move him down. And then you just want to stand just to the left of the center or the nose guard, as you see right here. And you're going to get these really glitchy loop blitzes. Now, the thing about LB Blitz Zero that I want to make very, very clear is this defense is good because of its glitchiness of pressure. Okay, um, the pressure is kind of like random to a degree, it's especially the loop variations of this. So just keep that in mind. Um, and generally speaking, if you stand about right here, you are going to have pretty good uh, success with getting these kind of glitchy pass offs and, and all that logic that we love to get. OK, one way you can enhance this blitz a little bit is to make sure that when you stack these guys, you're stacking them on the hip of the defensive player. And this, as you see right here, we're having a little trouble getting that guy stacked. Again, that's the bug in practice mode that we're, we're dealing with right now. But you see, able to get the loop blitz, able to get the disengage, and that's the idea. Now, the reason you send the five man out of LB blitz as opposed to sending four, which we've shown that as well, is you want to try to get this pressure to come home even if they block a running back, even if they block a tight end, okay? So against a block six or six man pass protection, you are going to see a lot of times we're still able to get this pressure home. And one other really underrated recommendation about running this defense is to press your coverage and shade your coverage over top. I think this is the best way to be running man-to-man -man right now. And this is the way you want to basically send five. And then, like I said, you I really like to shade over top. Now, we because we're shading over top, this allows us to scissor over here on the left side. And that running back will typically won't beat us for a touchdown. As you see, another big underrated thing is to have an absolute dog at that defensive tackle position. If you guys have a good pass rusher, you want your best pass rusher at the defensive tackle position, and you want to scissor if you're playing bunch. The reason why is because because we shaded over top, we'll be able to stop these snap throw wheels, and the shade over top will make sure that he doesn't get beat over the top. This is the best glitchiest defense in the game right now, in my opinion. And if you want to get the full defensive ebook on it, where we actually show you how to bag literally all kinds of different formations, you can get that by joining the Patreon today for just 10 bucks. The link is going to be down in the description below.